hello everyone today we are going to explain how to configure uip tunnel for configuring uip tunnel we need minimum two router the reason behind one will be corporate office another will be branch office right in our infrastructure also we have a two router this router our corporate office and this is our branch office and uh, we will configure sort of dcp server in this corporate office but we don't configure dcp server in branch office the branch office client pc will get ip from corporate office routers how the branch office pc will get ip from corporate office router using uip tunnel let's see how to configure it first of all we need to assign ip address because um, our both router fully resetted there is no configuration so we need to start from scratch so that we are going to log in our microtech router uh, we can assign a name system to identity like as a core for at router and this is will be our branch router system to identity okay now we need to configure ip address so go to the ip to address plus 192.168.1.1 slash 24 it will be our ethernet one okay apply okay then point to point ip address is 10 dot 0 dot 0 dot the corporate office ip address sn is done and the branch office branch office only point to point ip no need to configure lan right so just assign point to point ip 10 dot 0 dot 0 dot 2 slash 30 The point to point I Ethernet to it will be slash thirty. Okay, very good. Then you need to create interface or UAP tunnel. How to create UAP tunnel? A remote IP address, self LAN MAC address, and tunnel ID. Okay, so first of all, self LAN. Se our self LAN is Ethernet one. Interface. This is our MAC address. Just copy. Then click plus, and there is an option is UIP tunnel. UIP tunnel. Then just paste here the MAC address. And the remote address remote address 10.10.2 tunnel id we can use one here okay very good the uap tunnel configuration is done then add lan ether port and uip in breeze so that you need to create a breeze apply ok and port plus our uip tunnel lan interface is ethernet one ok then click plus then add uip tunnel here apply ok finally we need to configure DCP in bridge interface. Okay, 
IP, DCP, IP, DCP server, DCP setup, and click bridge. Next, 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 next. DNS. Next, next, finish. So the DCP server configuration is done. In the serve, uh, corporate office sites, our configuration is done. Here is a documentation, you can follow it. Let's go to the branch office. Branch office. So, you need to basic uh, configure one as we don't need to configure LAN here because of our LAN, our branch office, client PC will get IP from head office. Okay. So, create a UIP tunnel same remote ip self lan interface mac tunnel id go to the interface plus uip tunnel then self lan mac address our self lan is ethernet one just copy and paste it here and remote address remote address 10 dot 0 dot 0 dot 1 tunnel id 1 this side 10 dot 10 dot 1 yes right apply okay then add lan ether port and uip in breeze okay. you need to create a breeze here so branch of fish router port plus LAN Ethernet one connected and UIP connected. Apply OK. But you don't need to configure LAN here because this router's client PC will get IP from head office. In the corporate office router, go to the DCV server, IP to DCV server, go to the list on pc is getting ip address already now we are checking the branch office pc is getting ip address or not yes also branch office pc getting ip address ip to dscv server there is no dscv right whereas the branch office pcs are getting ip from head office thank you for watching